hey best friends so it's like 1 a.m i said 1 a.m it's 1 p.m i go about i got about 10 i've been up for four hours now and uh sorry if i'm about to rant uh my my emotions are a little high right now so sorry about this so i've been up for four hours right now right i have not talked to anyone I mean, I talked to my best friend Cassidy, but that's it. And only for a little bit. So, and I wanted to talk to my boyfriend. <gasps> friends. I, I think I've seen this episode. Sorry, Friends is on. <laughs> anyway, so I wanted to talk to my boyfriend because I haven't talked to him since last night. And I texted him like five times. This child did not answer. But finally, he got the audacity to text me back. I sent this really cute long paragraph. I don't know, he should be doing it. I sent this really cute long paragraph last night at 2 a.m. before I went to bed, right? And he didn't reply to it. And I thought, like, maybe when I wake up, I'd be like, oh, I love you too, or something. No! Finally, at, like, noon, after, like, I was, like, scrolling through TikTok and everything, he finally texted me back saying good morning. I literally, I was like, dude, like, what the heck? <laughs> So, I sent him the message again. I copied and pasted it. And I was like, and at the end, I was like, so did you see this message from last night? He was like, yeah, I did. Thanks. I love you. I was like, love you too. Yeah, I'm taking your place now because apparently you don't know how to send a long paragraph. Anyway, and then, like, uh, he texted me, like, what are you doing? And I was like, absolutely nothing. Apparently, he also doesn't know what. Uh, nothing in girl language means nothing means that we want you to y'all to FaceTime us, but boys are just dumb like that. So I've literally been just sitting on my bed watching Say Yes to the Dress and Friends all day and scrolling through TikTok. That's what I've been doing because apparently my boyfriend doesn't want to talk to me. And at first I thought he was doing one of those things like pranking me where he pretends that he's single for the day. Kind of scared me there. I was like, okay, so you want to play this game. You want to play the game where you don't have a girlfriend for a day. Okay, we can play this game. Because like, he wasn't responding. And normally he's up by like 10. He wakes up at like 6 o'clock. So I thought like, I thought I was going to get the no good morning text first. No, I had to send it. So I thought we were playing the game. Okay, we're single for the day. Apparently we're not. <laughs> So, like, sorry, I'm, like, really admiring my hair right now. So, the only people I've talked to today was my best friend Cassidy and my math teacher. If you're all like, why were you talking to your math teacher? You're off school. Well, my, see, my dad works at Chick-fil-A. And he saw my math teacher. See, my dad sees a lot of interesting people. And... Um, he sees a lot of my friends and my teachers, and he came across my math teacher, and he texted me saying, are you awake? I was like, yeah. And he was like, okay, I have someone here to talk to you if you're, if they agree to it. I was like, okay. So I thought it was my principal for a moment. I thought it was my principal, and I was like scared to death. And he had FaceTimed me. My hair was all messed up. I didn't even have like... I didn't, like, brush my hair or anything. And I thought he was going to come get me so I can go see them. No, he FaceTimed me. And he, like, I was like, are you ready? I was like, no, I'm scared. I was like, D so then he showed me my math teacher. I was like, oh, hey. <laughs> Oopsies. <laughs> Probably the most awful conversation I've ever had. Normally, I can ha have normal conversations with my math teacher because I've known my math teacher for almost eight years now. Because she's like a family friend of mine. Uh, and I've known her for eight years because her daughter went to school with my older sister. But, yeah. So, but <laughs> those are the only people I've talked to. is my best friend and my math teacher. And she asked me about eighth grade. If I'm scared to go, if, like, if I'm ready for that. I was like, no, I'm petrified. I'm going to be the big dog in school. And... Virgil's not ready for that. No, not at all. Anyway, but yeah, my boyfriend still hasn't got that, the hint that I really want to FaceTime. I haven't talked to him. And honestly, I don't really care.
It's almost two o'clock anyway. So we're talking about something care if I don't get to talk to him. Anyway, so I'll con- uh, thanks for watching my rant session. Make sure you like, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and if you're not already subscribed, make sure you hit that little subscribe button and join my family. Alright y'all. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys later. Bye y'all. Mwah.